this January for three roommates. Being human is harder than it looks. I'll invite the neighbors out for an evening. Being human is about uh, a ghost, a vampire, and a werewolf trying to cohabitate in a house. You remember that neither of us actually eats, right? Josh and Aiden move into the house that Sally died in. What the hell is this? What's it look like? I'm freaking out. What bonds those guys is this horrible adversity. They realize they can't do it alone. I wake up and I'm in hell. I'm in hell. I died and now I'm actually in hell. Aiden and I were just talking about how I'm in hell, but whatever, let's... Talk about you. The issues that the three of us are dealing with, a lot of people deal with. For Aiden, it's addiction. He's been trying to not be a vampire. Don't make me embarrass myself. Josh, he feels like an outcast. And the werewolf is sort of a symbol of this guy who's struggling with rage. I have to protect the world from myself. Sally's dealing with isolation, trying to find her place in the world. If I leave, don't forget me. I guess it takes that he doesn't even know I'm alive thing to a whole new level. Being human, it's extremely relatable. And I think that's what ultimately people are going to like about the show. We're not quite real, are we? Being Human, an all-new original series, premieres Monday, January 17th at 9, 8 central, only on Sci-Fi. Imagine greater.